As the Montana legislature enters its final days, lawmakers are busy putting the final touches on the $10 billion state budget. A key element of that process is something called a companion bill, where money or programs are stuffed into these bills at the last minute. The process has come under criticism, but today at the Capitol, lawmakers openly addressed these complaints and how things should work. MTN's chief political reporter Mike Dennison has the story. One week ago, Senate Bill 352 was a single open-ended sentence on transferring money in the state budget. But late last week, the House Appropriations Committee placed nine pages and $38 million in spending authority into this bill for programs and two dozen other bills. And now SB 352 is going to a six-member conference committee where it could get changed further as lawmakers hammer out the final budget. That move prompted some words of caution Wednesday on the Senate floor. I get a little nervous for the taxpayers of Montana because I am concerned that they will not have uh, part of the, be part of the discussion, quite frankly. Keep your eyes on it. This is when a lot of your bills that may have been met uh, demise and they may have had a little money in them. This is where we prioritize our session at the very end. Senate Bill 352 is one of several so-called companion bills which are used to tie up loose ends in the overall budget by the end of the session, which could come as early as next week. Most of the spending is in the main budget bill, House Bill 2. But a potential final vote on that bill was delayed Wednesday in the House. House Appropriations Committee Chair Nancy Balance of Hamilton told MTN News she wants to hang on to the bill until she's assured the companion bills cover any spending outside of HB 2. Critics of the process say companion bills have been used to insert spending or pet projects that didn't get approval in the regular process. But Senate leaders on Wednesday insisted the process is an open one. In terms of transparency, uh, I think this is a, actually an advance to the system. Uh, back in the day uh, when uh, uh, just a couple people uh, sat around after House Bill 2 had passed and they had two piles of bills. Ones that were in, ones that were out. The proof will be in the pudding as these bills undergo any last minute changes in these final days of the session. At the Capitol, Mike Dennison, MTN News. The session is scheduled to finish no later than May 1st, but it could wrap up by the end of next week.